Hey guys, I'm here at Carl's window tinting to get the car tinted. Got the car here at Don Hansen's alignment in the town of McHenry, Illinois to be aligned. This shop was referred to me by Custom Classics who did the lowering on the car. And uh, so here is the sign, 815-788-1878. And uh, decent shop, so we'll see how it goes. In the town of McHenry, Illinois, to be aligned. And um, they're gonna let me film it with it up on the on the alignment rack so we'll uh, we'll see how that goes I will post the phone number as well for you guys it looks like it's 815-385-0724 we got it up on the rack there's the underside again kind of cool that the suspension arms you can see are flush with the floor pan so better arrow coming out the back very cool Got old school on the left, new school on the right. Guys, here are some numbers for you. Uh, there's the shop, Don Hansen's Alignment, 1313 North Drive, McHenry, Illinois, 815-385-0724. So here, is, here are all the numbers. I have no idea how to read them. I know what toe-in and toe-out and caster and camber are, but as far as reading actual and before and all of that, I'm, I'm really not sure, and cross-camber and everything. So, but for those of you that know, that's what you're looking at. So, um, yeah, it was $90 total. And, uh, yeah, so there's your numbers. I'm leaving it on the screen for a while so you guys have a chance to write down whatever you might want to write down or get a good screenshot of it. But, uh, again, there's no, no caster or camber adjustment uh, that they could find in the car, only wheel toe. But they did mention that... The camber was, um, the caster and camber were within spec, and in fact, the negative camber, the tiny bit of an added negative camber, will actually have a positive effect on the handling, so that's good. All right, so yeah, good. here's the car lowered and tinted. So you can see the, the tint on the side windows there. I really like the look of it, and uh. Definitely, uh, I think I'm going to keep the chrome trim and chrome door handles, at least for now. Uh, I did take it through the car wash, and it does scrape just, just a tiny, tiny bit on the, uh, the wheel guide rails on the underside of the car. Not enough to leave marks under the car or anything like that, but it does, it does touch them. So this is as low as I'd want to go for sure. But uh, you can see that the tint, you can see through it but it's dark enough that um, it still has a, a nice look. So, and there's Ben, my son-in-law. He does uh, a lot of my videoing and, and editing. All right, thumbs up. Wow, what are the odds? I went to pull out of uh, driveway and I uh, end up directly behind a Model 3. There are very few Model 3s around my area, and I happen to be behind one as I'm driving. Ha! Huh, pretty cool. Let's see if I can get a little bit of a side view of it as he goes around this corner here. Yep, he's got the 19-inch sport wheels on it. Very cool. If he stops somewhere, I'll say hey to him.
thought you guys would get a kick out of that.